Welcome back to Garden Ninja. Today I'm going to be showing you one of my new tools and how to use it. And it's this, a hurry hurry blade. So a hurry hurry is an ancient Japanese gardening tool. Now as the garden ninja, I thought it only right that I give you a quick video on how to use one of these bad boys. So come on, let's get cracking. The hurry hurry is great for getting rid of perennial weeds like this dock here. So you just literally pull, pull, pull. Aha, root intact. So another use for the hurry hurry is to dig little rows or trenches when you're sowing seeds. You use the sharp edge and you just score it along and then you can pop in seeds, pop, 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 all the way along. Super easy, super neat. So what you can also use the hurry hurry for is to clean out around roots, especially if you're going to be digging them out or cutting through a root. So you use the sharp end of the blade, you literally scrape away the soil, clean underneath, and then you can get a root saw in or a hacksaw to cut through that root. So it's really good for sort of fine excavations. So the hurry hurry is also really good for putting in bedding plants and plug plants, plants that aren't too big. So what you can do using the hurry hurry is literally dig out a hole like this, scraping away the soil. You can lift the plug plants. This one's a fuchsia. Carefully does it. And then literally backfill with the hurry hurry. Firm it in, leave any debris. And there you go. Now the blade on the Hori Hori is concave, so it bends in slightly when you hold it flat. And what this means is that you can dig out drills really easily and also use it as a quasi trowel to lift and shift small amounts of soil. Now this version has a clean sharp edge here and a pointed blade. Other Hori Horis may have a serrated edge, but mine doesn't. So you use the sharp edge for cutting through things and the thicker edge for working through soil. And when you're done using it, you can give it a quick clean off with some water, like so. Maybe a damp cloth, and if it does get dirty, you can use a cleaning rock just to clean off those edges. The other cool thing with the Hori Hori is that mine's come with this handy pouch that you can clip on to a belt. So when you're done with it, you can clean it off, pop it in, and carry on gardening. And then as soon as you see any pesky weeds, you can whip it back out, get rid of them, and then put it back in safely. What's not to love? So there we have it, my quick and easy guide to this, the Japanese Hori Hori Gardening Knife. If you've liked this video, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel, where there's plenty more garden design tips, tricks and hacks. Happy gardening!